One Thomas County art program needs your help, about $25,000 worth. I just see the need and I, I would like to fill it. I'm Candace Blake, your Thomasville neighborhood reporter, and I'm breaking down how one special needs nonprofit is servicing over 500 kids and how you can help. It's very important that she has this ADA regulated bathroom. Ashley Mervin worked for Friends and Stars Incorporated, an art program located in Thomas County for those with special needs. Mervin is talking about the nonprofit's latest venture, building an Americans with Disability Act compliant bathroom. When I came here, <clears throat> I noticed there was a lot of kids that they're not necessarily being, well, they're not being served. Dixie Lee Hedrington founded Friends and Stars Incorporated. The nonprofit teaches skills such as mosaic art, painting, and sculpting. People meet me all the time. Oh, you know, if I could do, I've always wanted to do something, but I only know how to do stick people. I asked Hedrington how they've been making do for the last 15 years. She says that they've been renting porta potties. Hedrington tells me that they can cost $100 a day per unit. Most of my clients are children with disabilities. Some are wheelchair bound, a lot of them are medically fragile. So if they need a change, we can't do that in a porta potty. The new bathroom would include handrails, a shower, and a changing table for adults. Hedrington says that the bathroom is estimated to cost $25,000. So to raise the money, the nonprofit is asking the community for their support. She has a heart of gold for kids with disabilities, not just because she's a parent, but she sees what it can do. Friends and Stars Incorporated will be hosting an art festival fundraiser called the Pecan Orchard on January 20th. Admission is free. I'm Candace Blake, your Thomasville Neighborhood Reporter, ABC 27.